Hey guys, welcome to Rock and Heat. Today we've got a, another one of the sauces that Debbie Bartram had sent me in a package a while back. It had gotten me, I think, on my birthday or something like that, so around mid November. And uh, yeah, so this is the Doopy, I, I, I would say Doopy, Doopy Jerk Jam. I'm wondering why it doesn't always want to just focus, but that's okay. It is my camera. I could do that. Oh, I guess that's just probably too close. It's probably about as close as I can get. Anyways, um, what does that do? Okay, I'm messing with my phone too much. <laughs> uh, this is from rockjamspices.co.uk. Uh, so you can go there to um, get this. It says warning hot on it. Uh, ingredients. So, well, it was this handmade in sunny Cornwall with fresh ingredients. Um, ingredients are dem demerara sugar, um, tomatoes, scotch bonnet peppers, red wine vinegar, garlic, ginger, allspice. And uh, yeah, sounds sounds right up my alley. Honestly, sounds like just like a nice, really sweet sauce that you could put on all sorts of meats and stuff. Um, yeah, so let's crack this open. Ooh. Yeah, it just smells real spicy and full of spices. I've actually been meaning to try this on some food recently. Um, I've even brought it with me to work. I've done a few things and just ended up not using it. Um, I've got some other hot sauces with me and stuff that I've ended up using instead. Um, yeah, so it's just kind of got that, um, you know, more thicker, like barbecue sauce consistency. You definitely um, sugary. All right, let's try this stuff out. This is the Doopy Jerk Jam by Rock Jam Spices. You know, it's got a more interesting flavor than I thought, but I've never had that sugar, whatever the sugar is before. I don't know if it's got a, a specific flavor to it. Um, it's sweet, very full of spices. I can taste the ginger and garlic for sure. going for a little more. I've always said the first taste that you get is always so-so because you're kind of, especially if you haven't eaten or drinking anything, drank, drunk, drinking, uh, anything in a while, uh, it kind of wakes your taste buds up. <coughs> Yeah, it's like sweet tomato, like very sweet tomato-y. But then with all sorts of spices thrown in there, um, it's a little bitter, um, not gonna lie. Even with all that sugar in there, I can taste a little bitterness, which has got me questioning, what exactly would I put this on? It's not bad. It's not my favorite um, sauce. Uh, I think what I would what I would do with this is um, 
like finish off some wings or finish off something on the grill with it and kind of glaze it, glaze it over with this stuff. Um, that would be perfect, I think. Um, it's very, even though, Old Spice. I forget what's all, what is All Spice exactly, but um, I feel like the sauce could use some, some salt or um, maybe just a tad bit of salt. Otherwise, I think it's pretty good. But yeah, you could use it as a glaze for a number of things. It's high in sugar. Um, meatloaf. It'd be good for meatloaf. This would be actually like perfect for meatloaf. All right, guys. Well, um, last night I tried to do a live stream on Rock and Heat, but I didn't have it set up for Rock and Heat. Apparently, my streaming software. I use OBS and uh, I accidentally had it linked to RC Bound, so it started streaming there. I, uh, I'm i going to stream a game called Wreckfest tonight and goof off. It's a, it's kind of a car racing game, uh, a lot about, you know, demolishing the cars and stuff like that. It's called Wreckfest. Um, it looks pretty fun, I've seen plenty of videos about it, but anyways. So I've got that downloading right now. It might be about done. But uh, I'm going to stream that. I'm going to stream it to my RC, oh, my Rock and Heat channel. I've got that linked up right. Um, most of you guys will either have seen the stream probably before this uploads. But that's what I'm going to be doing next after this. I hope everyone's been having a good day. I've been having a pretty good day. Um, still just been doing some electrical work on my house. Yeah, a little bit in the evenings when I get home from work. Um, trying to troubleshoot a couple of things, but yeah. That's kind of what's taking up my evenings. Other than just wanting to rest and relax. And then at that point, I just kind of flip through social media. And I, I don't really feel like putting the energy towards even playing games later, later at night recently. And, uh, uh, and or recording videos or anything, so... All right, guys, uh, I will see you in the next one, which I think will probably be a sauce from Uncle Remus or will either be a sauce um, from Funky Food with Dave. I haven't re re uh, uh, reviewed his Tropical Heat yet. I believe that's the other one I have. So, All right, stay tuned, guys. Uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.